and for the first time since 2013, the Bellarmine Prep Lions are a perfect 3-0. They get off to a slow start tonight against Bethel, but they turn it up in the second quarter, and they would never look back. The Bellarmine Prep and Bethel cheerleaders were providing plenty of school pride, and the Lions' den was rocking for the big game. It was a picture-perfect night for football, and it was Bethel on the attack in the first quarter. Martine Paz makes the grab, picks up 40 yards on the play. Pause a moment for Martine, because he was everywhere in the first quarter. This time he takes advantage of a bad snap, and Paz scores. It's 7-0 Bethel. Second quarter, here comes Bellarmine Prep. Peyton Faker throws a laser to Andrew Johnson. It's now a 7-7 game. Late in the first half, Peyton Faker strikes again. This time he finds his brother Ty for the touchdown. It's 21-7 at the half, and the Bellarmine students are fired up. Second half, and the brother duo keeps it coming. Peyton to Ty one more time, and Ty takes this one to midfield. That play helps set up this one. Faker hooks up with Andrew Johnson again, and the Lions take a 28-7 lead. Bethel tried to hurdle themselves back into this game, but the Bellarmine Prep defense didn't give up one point tonight. Caleb Strombeck with the tackle. Bellarmine Prep wins it 35-9. Proud of our defensive players, super proud of our staff, our defensive staff. Um, you know, they've got some dynamic kids that got, have some bounce and can move and go. And um, for the most part, we did a pretty good job. We'll go back and watch film and make our corrections, but super proud. Next week, Bellarmine Prep is on the road. They will face off against Emerald Ridge on Thursday at Spark Stadium. As for Bethel, it doesn't get much easier for them. They will now face one of the toughest teams in the state, undefeated Sumner. Live tonight from Bellarmine Prep, I'm Chris Egan, King 5 Sports.